I made $6,000 in 12 hours as a wholesaler, all because of a real estate license. This property in Mesquite, Texas, and for those of you that don't know where Mesquite, Texas is, it is right here. It's right outside Dallas. One of the sales agents at my company, Ethan Mullen, awesome guy, he was sleuthing on MLS and saw this property and they did a huge price cut. Check this out. It was listed for 260,000 and then they dropped the price to 200,000 down 23% in one cut. He saw that and he submitted an offer as a wholesaler. He's trying to get a property for cheap and then he's going to sign that contract, essentially sell the contract to an investor. And that investor usually pays something called an assignment fee. Now, most wholesalers don't have their real estate license. They are selling contracts, not homes. If you don't have your real state license you cannot legally sell a house so wholesaling is like a loophole but, but but by not having your license you yeah you you are probably missing out on tens of thousands or hundreds of thousands of dollars per year why because you can double dip most of you don't know this but you can get an assignment fee and a buyer's agent commission. You can get paid by the buyer, your assignment fee, and you can get paid by the seller, a buyer's agent commission as a realtor. So you can get paid as a wholesaler and a realtor in one transaction and make twice as much money. You probably think I'm bullshitting you. Hey, let me show you. Can't believe y'all don't believe me. This house, okay? My boy, Ethan, got it under contract. You won't believe this. He got it under contract for full asking price. He offered them $200,000. But in the contract, way at the bottom, he wrote, I will pay you full price for this house and I want a 3% buyer's agent commission. 3% of 200,000 is 6 thousand dollars the seller was like oh my god i'm getting a full price offer and i was already expecting to pay a three percent buyer's agent commission and a three percent listing agent commission their realtor for a total of six percent that's very normal in real estate usually sellers have to pay six percent in realtor costs so they were getting a full price offer and they were getting everything they wanted and everything they were expecting to get so guess what they did they said yes sis i'm signing it right now so ethan got it signed and then he sold the deal to one of his investors for your you won't believe this. How much do you think he sold it for? Well, if he got it for 200,000, he'd have to sell it for at least 206,000, right? To make 6,000, right? No, he, sold, he got it under contract, guys, for 200,000 and he sold it for 200,000. Now, most of you wholesalers are like, oh my God, that's a $0 assignment fee. I wouldn't have made any money. But y'all are forgetting he got paid $6,000 by the seller. So he didn't need to get money from the buyer. The deal was tight and he couldn't even charge the buyer 201,000, 202,000 because there wasn't enough room. And that's why, and guys, this is the most important thing I'm gonna mention in this video. That's why Ethan got the deal and you didn't. And all the other wholesalers in Dallas, Fort Worth, the tens of thousands of wholesalers didn't get the deal because they didn't have their real estate license and really just think about it here for another wholesaler to make money they would have had to get the property under contract at 194 and then sell it at 200,000, right but to a seller they get a contract for 194 and they're like no i wanted 200 i wanted my number now yeah it's the same difference let's be honest it's the same difference you're getting 200,000 minus 6,000, or you're getting 194,000 minus zero it's the same thing but to a seller it's not it's not it's a dollar amount they see a contract for 200,000, they they're so happy so that's why ethan was able to get that deal a deal that had no room and was not possible for any other wholesaler ethan was able to get it and not you and make six thousand dollars in 12 hours because he had his real estate license. There are a lot of benefits to being a licensed wholesaler. At my company, we have 17 full-time agents and every single one of them is licensed. We're a licensed brokerage. Everything we do is licensed. And there is a myriad of reasons we can talk about the legality of wholesaling, where the industry is going, and I'll make a future video on that. So make sure to subscribe. Hit that, hit that subscribe button right down there. But guys, just right off the bat, one of the reasons you should get your license, and it's not only for clout reasons, and you're able to get more deals because you're like, hey, I'm an agent. No, no, it's because you can make more money. You can make $6,000 in 12 hours just because you had your real estate license and that will pay for all the course fees. That will pay for all the MLS fees. I'm not even talking about MLS. That's so great too. That will pay for all the association fees. Guys, that will pay for the time and pain in the butt of getting your license. You close a deal like that every month, 
you're looking good. And you guys think I stopped there? We do these deals all the time. If you are wholesaling on market real estate, if you're going on Zillow, Redfin, Realtor.com, or you have software like PropWire, PropStream, Privy, or you have MLS like me, because I'm a licensed agent, you can find cheap homes on MLS, negotiate them down, and then flip those contracts and make money as a wholesaler, never having to do direct to seller, never ever having to cold call or do blast text campaigns or door knock or you know do ppc ppl ai and all that crazy stuff mailers no 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 just go on MLS and get properties under contract and flip those contracts. It's super easy, but it's so much easier if you have your license and you can make twice as much. So in the first example I showed you, I'm gonna show you another example here. I showed you how you get paid by the seller, but let me show you an actual double dip in the flesh. This video I made here is actually a double dip. Oh my God, guys, they flipped the house. We sold this house a couple months ago and look, they flipped it. Whoa, it looks beautiful. Wow. We sold this house for $300,000. The seller's asking $500,000. That's awesome. I hope he sells it. I hope he makes a lot of money. What a beautiful flip. Anyways, when we sold the house, it didn't look like that. And it wasn't $500,000. So let me show you. This is what the house looked like. It was your boring old house and it was listed on mls for like 300 something thousand and we ended up getting under contract for 285,000. we sold it like i said for 300,000. so we made a fifteen thousand dollar assignment fee but actually we made twenty four thousand dollars how could that be well we got a three percent buyer's agent commission. So we bought it for 285, we sold it for 300,000, and then we got paid 3% of 285, which is about $9,000 for a total of 24,000. We made an extra $9,000 all because we had a real estate license. So guys, girls, what I'm trying to say here, if you're wholesaling, one of the reasons you should absolutely get your real estate license is because it makes you more money. Again, I think it helps you get more deals. I think it'll protect you from future legislation. I think MLS is invaluable. I think there are so many reasons you should get your real estate license, but above all else, if you're a wholesaler, guys, get your real estate license because you can double dip and make twice as much money and you can get deals that nobody else could because you can offer more at least on paper to the seller it's more money i hope this video was helpful i encourage you all to go and get your real estate license if you're wholesaling between us not the biggest fan of realtors but i am one i ain't trying to you know self-harm myself but realtors sort of suck but guys wholesalers with the realtor license those people are awesome and you should absolutely be one of them if you enjoyed this video and this was helpful please subscribe and i'll see you in the next video see you guys bye